Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm doing something very out of the ordinary for my channel, but I'm super excited about it. We are getting chickens today. Yes, we are getting chickens. Um, my husband and I are going to put together the chicken coop today. I'm gonna go to get the chickens, get all the supplies. I'm gonna bring you along with us. Uh, stay tuned. Yes, I'm an amateur. I'm a beginner. I've done my research, but I also have never done this before. So if you have wanted to start chickens or do this whole process and you are scared to, well, you can watch this video and learn from my mistakes, hopefully see what I'm doing. And if you have any chicken advice, comment down below, please give it to me. Um, I need it. So we're gonna get started building the chicken coop. It's right there. Um, and I'm gonna have a discount code below for y'all to grab the chicken coop yourself or any of them uh, from this brand uh, at a discount. So now is your time to get a chicken coop with me if you wanna get a good deal. Okay y'all, so I'm super excited about this chicken coop. This brand was really easy to put together myself. Um, I'm not the handiest person ever and I really had no problems. All of the materials were clearly labeled. Um, the instructions were super easy and I was able to do this all by myself with no problem. I highly recommend this chicken coop. I love the layout as you will see whenever I'm done. Um, it's perfect for a chicken coop in the country or in town too, but especially if you're in town and you're just looking for something small, this is perfect as well. So I'm going to link this down below. The company has been so gracious and given a coupon. I will link it down below. Make sure to click it um, to grab one at a discount. Okay, y'all, here are all of the pieces. The instruction manual says it takes 45 minutes with two people. There is just one of me, so I'm guessing maybe like an hour and a half. There are a lot of pieces, but the instructions look really easy. So we are gonna go ahead and get started. Okay, I wanted to uh, pinpoint this tray right here. It's really neat. It slides underneath the coop and also has a latch to lock it in so that predators cannot um, take the drawer out of the coop. Like if you're trying to get eggs or clean out the bottom. There are some other really neat features that I love about this chicken coop, including the latches that are on all of the doors and on the fencing um, very good locks and um, they're going to keep predators out
Okay, another great feature that I love is this waterproof um, stripping that you can place on the side of the coop. This keeps water from leaking into the little hen house part where they lay their eggs. Um, and there's one on each side and I really love that feature to keep the hens safe and warm. When I see you, my heart starts racing, but I don't know if I like this chasing and playing and waiting around. It's a shame that my hands start shaking all of the time when you're around me. But this time, this time, girl, I know what's bothering me. I need somebody to love. Oh, na, 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 na. Don't you see? Starts racing, but I don't know if I like this chasing and playing and waiting around. It's a shame that my hands start shaking all of the time when you're around me. But this time, this time. Okay, y'all, it's done and that was super easy. I am super impressed with how this turned out. I really like this cage and how it's low to the ground. All right, y'all, we made it to Tractor Supply. We're gonna check out the chicken. Okay, I got my chickens right here. I'm super excited. Um, I only got six because that is the max for my chicken coop. And you know, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to keep all of them alive, just trying to be realistic. Hopefully they're all healthy, but if one of them doesn't make it, you know, we're good. Um, but I got three Rhode Island Reds and three speckled Sussex hens, I believe. Um, they had those and then they had a different kind, but I just got those. Um, they were already together in a bin, so I figured that, that they would get along because they were already together. Um, but anyways, we are gonna head home. I'm gonna set them up. Um, they're so cute. I'm so excited. Okay, look. Don't poop. poop. You're gonna pick one up. <laughs> Mommy, Mommy, pick yeah. one up for me. Just grab one, Trip. Mommy, pick Don't one up. Don't squeeze it too hard. Mom, pick me, pick me one up. You do it, Vera. Pick one up. Oh. <laughs> no, I want you to pick me up one. Did I pick one up? One Vera, I'm scared you're gonna drop it. Ah! Here. Pick up another one, Trip. I want to, I want to pick one up for me, Mom. Okay, but I'm scared you're gonna drop it. Mm. Don't squeeze it too hard. Sure. 
see this one already pooped. Which one? It's okay. <laughs> yeah, but these has are the paper towel. There they are. Aww. Mine does no poop. It's okay. Poop. Let's make sure they all know where the water is. Tweet, 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 tweet. Tweet. But the chickens are stepping in poop. I know. So this water, I added some electrolyte powder for chickens in it, just to make sure they're hydrated. It's really hot here, and I read that that's good. I also bought this. Um, we got chicken food. Yes. The kids are so excited. No, except poop. they're pooping everywhere. Let's see if I can open it. Ooh. Can I help you do some? Can I do some? Baby, hold on. You can do the other stuff. Sprinkle it on there. Oh. Okay, that's good. That's it? Mm -hmm. No more? Should be good. Okay guys, I wanted to come here and check back in with y'all. It has been about a week, probably a week and a half, since we've gotten our chickens and they are doing really well. So I wanted to update y'all on what I've learned. Hi chickies. Okay, so um, I think that they are about two to three weeks old right now. And what we have learned is that if the box is not high enough, they will jump out as you can see. Um, the bedding I did buy and I changed it out. Like, look how high that jump was. I changed the bedding out every like four days. And we also put a piece of wood underneath the food right here so that they would stop getting poop and shavings in their food and their water. So I do clean their water a couple of times a day. Um, and I feel like it, it's better for them to have, you know, clean water. So I'm actually gonna change the shavings out right now and move them into another box temporarily. All right, there you go. So they've got a clean bucket now. Okay guys, that is it for this video. I'm gonna link the chicken coop down below and the company out. You get a 5% discount whenever you purchase one. They're really great, really love it, and it was a really good purchase for us. So very thankful again um, for them to work with us in this video. I hope that y'all enjoy. Stay tuned for our next chicken video. Oh, I spilled the water, spilled the chicken water. So I will see y'all in the next video. I'll do another chicken update video uh, probably whenever we do put them in the coop officially. So I will see y'all next time. Bye everybody.